Hey everybody, welcome back. I have a slight, small haul. First thing I'm going to show is I invested in, yes, a selfie stick. Easier to handle when I'm trying to do my videos or take pictures of, you know, a bunch of us together or something like that. Still sucks I have to use one hand, but it's not going to be that that difficult. Okay. I wear makeup, I know, but I am sweating so bad. It's so humid here, and I feel like I'm sweat my makeup off to where it looks blotchy again. But anyway, I went to, first thing is, of course, I went to Walmart, and that's where I got this. It was $4.88, so that's not too bad. And it's pink. You can't see it because I'm using it. Um, the next item, nothing major from Walmart. I only bought two items at Walmart. Or no, three, but my mom bought one of them. It, of course, got to have oatmeal cream pies. Matter of fact, I'm going to eat one because I have No, you've already had one. Anyway, um, the next item is a pair of shoes. Yes, a pair of shoes. I don't never buy shoes. I'm always thinking of everybody else first. But my mother bought these shoes for me. God, God love her because I needed a pair of tennis shoes really bad. And this is what they look like. Just, they're Avias. I don't know. They fit good. That's all I care about. I don't care about brands as long as they were reasonably priced. Which these were, I think, these might have been $20. So, I mean, the last pair I bought from Walmart, they lasted me four years. So, but I needed a pair of shoes really bad. Um, the next item is, um... A Dollar Tree. We went to Dollar Tree. I didn't get much at Dollar Tree either. Um, just trying to watch finances. Um, but I got me a, another coffee mug. Look, guys. <laughs> to go with my... Um, what is it? Uh, the other coffee cup I have. I don't smell anything. Um, dish soap, because I needed more dish soap with my sensitive hands. And thank God they have this at Dollar Tree, or I would be in in worse shape. And then I found these. Finally getting Christmas stuff at my Dollar Tree. Slowly but surely, but I saw these and had to have them. Look at these. They're socks. They're big, long socks. I figured these would be so cute to wear during the holidays when I'm slumming around my house and stuff. Oh, these are so cute. Isaiah, look at my socks. Aren't they cute, guys? So cute, so cute, so cute. So I'm going to walk around. Whoa, I'm about to trip over the cord for the computer because Isaiah's playing on the computer. But how's everybody doing today? I hope everybody's well. I had a great time with my mother. Um, I don't know what's going on lately. Oh, it's dark. Hold on. Sorry I'm eating, guys, but I'm starving. But Uh, David told me what happened. Yeah. Do they know uh, wh whose number was it? They got my account number. Somebody got my account number. You know, that happened to my mom last week. I can't understand you. That happened to my mom last week. Oh. So it was her credit card. Oh. Well, they've already given me the money back. The bank. I guess they just absorbed it. I don't know. That's part of their marketing. Yeah, because that's what mom says. The uh, the, I think it was their Visa credit card that got hacked, and she said, "I don't even know how that happened because they haven't used that card since they, they went said, on vacation." They got checks and had my account number encoded on the bottom, just like it was my check. But it says uh, Winston's Food and Spirits, Sandy Plains Road. <laughs> so I thought 
think somebody is over there. I don't know if the manager or something mm -hmm. created these, but I don't know how they got my account number. Yeah, because David said they were an astronomical amount. It was, uh, both of them was, one's at 877, one's at 840-something. Anyway. And the yeah. bank caught on to it? No, my account was way overdrawn this morning. And so I called and, they, and I said, uh, these are fraudulent checks. So they put a, they froze the account and I had to go down there. See, I've had the same account number for so long. I had it memorized now. Anyway. Yeah, because see, Mom said the first time it was like, well, then they were online purchases. Yeah. And she said one of them was $100, like $90. She says then they tried it again, and that's when the credit card caught on because, you know, they know you're... Uh, yep. So, so I tried to use my Chase card in Las Vegas to buy $5 worth of gas, and they declined it. Saying, this is, you don't normally buy gas. Oh, Lord. What is that you're holding? It's a selfie stick. Oh, God. Okay. These things are pretty cool. I saw somebody at the Fall Festival walking around with it, and I wished I'd have had one. But anyway, sorry about that. I got, had to find out information. Oh, now you can see my makeup. My eyes have been watering so bad, y'all. I don't know why. Okay, so my makeup don't look quite as dark. I need to get me... This is foundation I had like... Oh, gosh. I'm not used to this thing. Um, This is foundation I had like during the summer. And I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it at all. It's too dark. So I need to... I went to Walmart today and I just kind of looked around... And I guess I'm going to have to go back to the foundation I was using before. Um, actually, I think what made this so dark was the bronzer I used. I didn't. I don't like the bronzer. I've tried to make it work. I really did. I've used it a couple of times. And I just don't like it. And this foundation, you can see it makes my face um, more oily. So, I think I'm going to try... I used to wear the Maybelline Fit, and I think I'm going to go back to that. I'm going to go back and get me some. They have it at Walmart, and it was like 6 bucks for the foundation, and 6 something for the powder, for the matching powder. So, I think I'm going to go back, because I think I need more of a... Uh, my, my problem is I have red in my skin. My ha I have a lot of red tones, and not pink red and so my problem is um finding a good foundation that's reasonable priced and um what's the word the, the word i'm looking for reasonably priced but good for the skin good for my kind of skin I have oily skin so I need I do need the matte I do need the matte foundation and powder and I want y'all to look I'll pull it out look there my hubby say hi are you saying hi I can't see you <laughs> he says hello everybody but anyway so that's my dilemma what y'all heard was uh this has happened to two people in the last week my mother and my father-in-law both of their accounts have been hacked i've heard on the news that there has been this issue going around that people are hacking into um, your credit cards and your bank accounts and what happened with my mother it was her credit card her visa credit card and luckily visa called on to it well what happened to my father-in-law that's what he was saying is somebody made checks using his account number 
and um, using his account number and each of them was like over eight hundred dollars at a restaurant so I don't know who did that and I hope they find out who did because that ain't cool so when you're using your credit cards here's my advice when you're using your bank cards whether it be getting gas or even paying be paying you know never use your card over the phone never use your card at your gas pumps it's even I've even heard that you should not use your bank card at your gas at the gas pumps go inside because they have these little machines they've come out with these little computerized things that they once you swipe that card it automatically reads your account number and as soon as you punch in your pin code it reads your pin code I mean it's a it just blows my mind this day and time how people can be that selfish and, and want to you know take advantage of people who you know, like my father-in-law who are on fixed incomes or like my dad and my mom who work hard for their money and you know my father-in-law worked for 30 years or more working at the Federal Reserve where are they cash checks so you know it's just really sad that things like that have to happen to innocent people so be cautious of your surroundings and what you do with your credit card numbers um, yep I guess that's all I'm gonna hop off of here and 